I'm at Old Town Automobile here in Maryland. I'm excited. I'm going to go see the prettiest Willys I hope I've ever seen. I've heard a lot about the car. I heard it's a hell of a car. It's red. Red's my favorite color. And I'm going to buy that car if it's what I want. This is my first time at Old Town Automobile. I'm looking forward to meeting these people. They seem real nice. And hopefully, we can make a friendship and do a lot of business. Hey, Ted. How are you doing? I'm good. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Welcome to Old Town Automobile. Wow. <laughs> hey, let me introduce you to Courtney. Come on Please, in. Yes, thank you. Old Town Automobile came together about 10 years ago. My father was big time into cars. My sister handles the day-to-day -day operations. My brother buys and sells vehicles. It's kind of a complete family thing, something we've done for years. Hey, Courtney. Hello. Hey. This is Ted. Hey, Ted. You stopped in to see you. All right, buddy. Enjoy. <laughs> how you doing? Hey, Courtney. Nice to meet you. Good to meet Good. you, sir. My brother Lance. Hello, Lance. How, how you, you doing? doing? Nice, to meet you. nice to meet you. You guys look like a football team. <laughs> yeah. You guys got some real nice cars. Every one of these been through your shop? Every one of them has been fully serviced through our shop. What about this Willys you want to show me? The Willys over here, but I have a few cars I'd like to show you before that and show you around the shop. I am blown away by how nice every one of the cars is. It's not a project here. They're all perfect. They're all done. He's got a right-hand drive pickup that I could sell to the UK or back to Australia. He's got Chevelles here that are to die for. He's got a 41 Willys pickup one of one that I could also maybe buy in case I can't buy the coupe. He's got a 70 split bumper Camaro over there that is a pro street car. He's got great cars. Just every one of them is nice. But I came here to buy the Willys if I can. You ready to show me what I came for? Oh, yes, sir. That's it there, Ted. We actually built this car 10 years ago for a local customer here in town. He drove it around a little bit. It was on the ISCA show circuit for quite a while. Did real well. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. It's a complete rotisserie done supercar. Now, this is built so well, it's a glass car. And it looks yes, and sounds it is. like a metal car. Yes. We pretty much built it the way we'd like to see it built. It looked just like a metal car. It's got a lot of nice one off features. Boyd Coddington hand built the wheels and many so pieces the, for the car. Those are Boyd's, huh? Yes, but they're one off custom made just for this car. But I'm trying to find something to pick, and I can't find something to pick on the well, car. Yeah. So what kind of money is this car going to cost me in reality? When we built the car, it cost right around 200000 The problem is you can buy a car a lot cheaper than you can build it. We're asking 150000 well, That's what we'd like to get for the car, but we'll listen to a reasonable offer. Courtney's asking $150,000 for the car. I'd be thrilled if I could get it in the low hundreds. I got to see where he's at. I mean, 150 is out of the question. I can't. But somewhere between 100 and 150, if we could get together, we will. So how much do you want to sell me this $100,000 car for? Oh, come on, Ted. You're killing me. That's what I'm here for. I know. And that's what I want to pay. I'll stroke you a check for 100 right now. Man, I can't do 100 on it. I want to be able to buy cars from you on the telephone. Mm -hmm. And I can see by what you have, I can do that. I think our bottom line is going to be about 135 on it. Man, I got to be able to buy this car and sell it. Yeah, and I don't think this car is going to sell for more than uh, 130, 140. In your market down there, it's going to do real well. How about 110 and we call it a day? Can't do it, buddy. We might be able to do uh, 125, but that's it. I'm done. I've heard that expression before. That's stealing it. Give you my last shot. I'll pay you 120 for the car, and we are done. $120,000. All right, buddy. That's ice parker. Huh. My car? Your car. Let's go do the paperwork and get your free T-shirt and a tank of gas. <laughs> All right? That's great. A tank of gas, too? Yeah, tank of gas. Ted's a good negotiator. He got a $200,000 car for $120,000. Normally, we don't give that much on a deal because most of our cars are priced real close to what we want out of them. But to break the ice with Ted, we were willing to negotiate that low just so we could do future business with him. Next time, I'll get him. After meeting Courtney and seeing how fair he was and seeing the quality of his cars, I think this could be the start of a really nice relationship. Seems like a terrific straight up guy. I got the Willys, which is why I came here. And it's way, way beyond anything I expected to see. It's coming back to Miami.